Hey YouTube, opinionated reviewer here, and in this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can downgrade from iOS 4.3.4 or even iOS 5.0 back to iOS 4.3.3 or any other iOS version that you have your SHSH blobs backed up to. So you're going to need a couple things for this. You're going to need Tiny Umbrella. You're going to need the IPSW of the firmware you want you want to downgrade to. For this for this video, I'm going to use 4.3.1, but you guys most likely wouldn't be looking for 4.3.3. And you're going to need iReb. I'm going to have the link down in the description for where you can download all of the things that you need. You're going to also need to have your, your SHSH blobs backed up using Tiny Umbrella. There's several tutorials on that. If you don't know how to do that, there's also going to be a link in the description to take you to a post showing you how to do that. So with that being said, let's get into this tutorial. First thing we're going to do is put our iDevice into DFU mode. I have an iPod Touch, so that's what I'm going to select. So we're going to hold the home and the power button for 10 seconds. Release the power button. Keep on holding the home button for 15 seconds or until iRev recognize our iDevice. So let's select our iDevice and get ready. So let's go. One, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi, six Mississippi, seven Mississippi, eight Mississippi, nine Mississippi, ten Mississippi. Release. 1 Mississippi, 2 Mississippi, 3 Mississippi, 4 Mississippi, 5 Mississippi, 6 Mississippi, 7 Mississippi. I read recognize the ID device so we can just leave it. That's it. Just click OK. Now we're going to close out iRab and open up Tiny Umbrella. Click yes. I'll have the link down in the description where you can download everything you guys already know to check the description. As you can see, I have my iPod Touch here and all of my SHSH blobs are backed up from 4.3.1 to 4.3.3. And to make things interesting, I'm going to downgrade to 4.3.1. My iPod Touch is currently on 4.3.3 already. So yeah, all you got to do is click Start TSS Server. So we're going to click Start TSS Server. And now we're going to open up iTunes. You can minimize that and open up iTunes. It's going to recognize your iDevice in recovery mode, so we're going to click press shift on the keyboard and hit restore. And now we're going to browse for our iOS 4.3.3 firmware. Now you're downloading to 4. Point, you're downgrading to 4.3.3. I'm just doing 4.3.1 for fun. So yeah, you look for your i your 4.3.3 and click on it, then click restore. Now iTunes is going to work its magic. I'm going to come back when iTunes is finished. So now that iTunes is finished, I'm just going to go in the settings, general, about. And you can see that my iDevice is on iOS 4.3.1. So that's it. A quick tutorial. You can actually use this method to downgrade to any iOS version once you have your SHSH blobs backed up with Tiny Umbrella. With that being said, please rate, comment, subscribe. Have a nice day.